we are also clear that this administration, uh, as a policy, does not tolerate uh, or does not politicize security interventions. So we are saying that um, all political players in this county and indeed in other parts of the country are free to engage in their political activities, even to compete and have different opinions and ideas. We have no problem if politicians do not agree on issues and, uh, and uh, policy matters, because that is what is expected of them. However, they need to know that clearly nobody is allowed to commit crime hiding under politics. And for us, we are not looking even at the political affiliation of the offending characters. We are going to go with them after them impartially. And they should not try to think that we will uh, consider anything else, except that they, they are organizing, financing, and inciting violence. It doesn't matter whether they are from what political shade we will go after them and we'll arrest all of them we don't even care how much influence a politician has a lawbreaker is a lawbreaker period and please they must everybody must respect the law nobody is above the law it doesn't matter whose friend you are whose enemy you are we are all bound by the law and by the constitution. You saw last year how we almost destroyed our country when we had many, some of our people who uh, protesting or expressing their political opinions through violent protests. You saw we lost a bit of infrastructure. Uh, many people were inconvenienced, blocking of roads, stoning of cars and buildings. Uh, and, and at that time, uh, those who were organizing those violent riots were telling us they are exercising their right to demonstrate. The right to demonstrate does not include the right to destroy buildings, the infrastructure, and it does not include the right to hurt other Kenyans. So there must be uh, that understanding. Otherwise, we will work and support every leader uh, to realize their mandate, MCAs, MPs, governors, irrespective also of the party in which they are elected. It's our business to facilitate them, to secure their meetings, to make sure that their meetings are orderly, but it's also our business to punish them, to arrest them and prosecute them when they break the law.